Hey everybody, welcome back to Hood Time Welding with Everett. So today we have a crack to fill in, or this crack on this aluminum housing. Well, more like a hole. And um, I doubt you're going to be able to see it on video, but there's actually also a crack right here. Um, it's real hard to see, but it starts about here, goes across, and it's sort of working its way down here. So what I'm going to have to do is... First, this is a cast housing, so it's not going to be fun to begin with. But it's also aluminum, and it's probably dirty because it's been on for years. So what I'm going to do first is drill two holes at the end of either end of the crack. Um, the hole itself, I'm going to have to build it up some and try to flush it out. Uh, but what we'll do is I have a stainless steel wire brush. I'm going to wire brush each spot a little bit. And then I'm going to actually use some acetone to try to clean out that spot or clean it out a little bit more. I mean, it's it's still real dirty, so we'll see how we can do. Uh, it's to a, I want to say a 1980-something um, motorcycle. And the customer said he's having a real time hard time um, getting parts for it anymore. So we're going to try to do what we can with this one. But it's not going to be the easiest because, like I said, uh, it's been impregnated all these years with oil. Plus, just the regular casting problems you have all welding on casting to begin with. So, like I said, to begin with, we'll wire brush it, then we'll clean it with acetone, um, and we'll get the get some holes drilled out on that crack, try to keep it from spreading, and we'll go from there. Um, probably going to be a pretty short video, but we'll see how it goes. So this is what happens when you forget to press record on the time lapse. You miss the original cleanup, drawing the holes, and most of the welding. I did catch just a little bit there where I was just fixing a couple little holes. But it's not like I can go back and re redo taping because it's already fixed. Sorry about that. So I don't know how much I actually caught of welding, I um, did my usual. So you can see the outside, I got that hole filled in, um, some pinholes on the inside a little bit, uh, or I don't even know if those are pinholes, I don't know if those are just marks from the grinder, but I think it's pretty well sealed, it's hard to do on this cast because every time you go over it you just get another little pinhole, you think you got it, there's another one. But I think it'll hold oil just fine, we'll have to get it back to the customer, see what he thinks. And that's all there is for today. As usual, if you like my content, big thumbs up, and we'll talk to you later.